Welcome to Setup Mastery, your go-to channel for all things tech. Here, we explore the latest gadgets, unbox cutting-edge devices, and provide step-by-step -step installation guides to help you optimize your setup. Subscribe now and join our journey to master the art of perfect setups. In today's video, we'll guide you through the step-by-step -step process of resetting your Netgear Nighthawk EAX80 Wi-Fi extender. Whether you're troubleshooting connection issues or just need a fresh start, resetting your extender is quick and easy. Let's get started. There are several reasons to reset your Nighthawk EAX80. Maybe you're experiencing connectivity problems, planning to sell the device, or just want to reconfigure it. Resetting restores the extender to its factory default settings, removing all current configurations. Before proceeding with the reset, ensure that your Netgear Nighthawk EAX80 is properly plugged into a power outlet and powered on. Additionally, have a small paper clip or a comparable tool handy to press the reset button effectively. Next, find the reset button located on the bottom of your Nighthawk EAX80 extender. Take the paper clip and firmly press and hold the reset button for approximately 10 seconds. You'll notice the power LED blinking, signaling that the reset process is now underway. Once you release the reset button, the Netgear Nighthawk EAX80 will begin the rebooting process. Please allow a few minutes for this to complete. When the LED lights stabilize, it confirms that the extender has successfully reset to its original factory settings. After completing the reset, it's essential to set up your Nighthawk EAX80 extender once more. To do this, reconnect the device to your Wi-Fi router. You can configure the settings easily using the Nighthawk app or by accessing Netgear's setup page through your web browser.